Hey guys, it's Molly and today I'm back with another video. So today's video is going to be a, another collab with Amy Lynn and if you guys haven't watched our other collab, it's our top 10 scary movies in honor of Halloween. So go check that out. I have it linked down below, both of our videos. Um, but this that was her collab idea and then this one is my collab idea. So she's going to be doing a nighttime look for fall and I'm going to be doing a daytime look for fall. So yeah I don't have it on right now because um I I don't know I just want to do the intro first and if my eyebrows look like they're weird it's because I started doing them and I was like wait I gotta show you guys how I do them so I stopped so they're halfway done right now um but yeah if you guys are new definitely make sure to subscribe and hit the bell next to the subscribe button so you can be notified every time that I upload I do hauls, unboxings, tutorials, story times, pretty much anything so if that's anything you're interested in then definitely subscribe and without further ado let's get into the tutorial so I'm gonna be starting off this look with the LA Colors eyebrow kit in the shade medium and I'm using the first lighter shade um, with a angled brush just like this one and what I'm doing with this color is I'm actually going to be filling in the first half like to my arch with this color um, I don't know why I do them like this I just do and then I'm gonna be using the next darker shade in that same little kit and I'm gonna be filling from my arch to my tail kinda like a gradient effect Now I'm just using a spoolie and I'm going to be blending um, the two shades together and making it look very pretty. And then to set my eyebrows I'm using the Maybelline Great Lash Clear Mascara which isn't so clear anymore but I'm just going to be running it through my eyebrows to set um, the powder and ensure that my eyebrows are going to stay on all day. And now I'm going to be using the Urban Decay Primer Potion to prime my eyeshadow so that the eyeshadow stays on all day. And for this look we're going to be using the Too Faced Sweet Peach Palette which I'm sure you guys all know what this looks like and how it is and we're going to be using the shade Peaches and Cream with a shader brush like this and we're going to be setting the um, eyeshadow primer with this shade. Next we're going to be using the shade Puree from that same palette and a crease brush that looks fluffy but it's kind of pinched so it's kind of flat at the same time and this is going in our crease and kind of dragged down on our lid as you guys just saw me do and basically this is going to be our transition shade so yeah you're just going to put it in your crease and then we're also going to blend it up so it kind of looks more diffused. Now we're going to be using this shade called Charmed I'm Sure, which I don't understand that name, but we're going to be using that shade with that same brush and this is going directly in our crease. Um, and then you're going to want to like blend the two shades together and blend it to look almost gradient like and yeah that's pretty much all we're doing with that shade. Now we're going to be using the shade called Luscious. Fun fact, I used to have a YouTube channel called Makeup So Luscious 101. <laughs> and then we're going to be using this kind of flat shader brush, which actually is a concealer brush in case you guys didn't know. And this is going to be going on our lid, as you can see here. That's pretty much the only place it's going. Thank you. 
With that same brush that we just used, we're going to be using the same two shades that we put in our crease. I'm actually pointing at the wrong one, but Puree and Charmed, I'm sure. And they're going to be going underneath our lash line. And then to highlight the brow bone, we're using the shade White Peach and Peaches and Cream. And I forgot to show the brush, but it's just like a small shader brush like this. And we're just highlighting the brow bone. And to do my upper eyeliner, I'm using the e.l.f. cream eyeliner in black and then a small angled brush from Morphe. And I didn't show you guys how I do it because I'm going to be doing a separate video all about my wings. But this is how the finished look is, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed. Definitely let me know about down below if you will recreate this. So that was the finished look, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed. I was going to show you guys my face, but my battery is dying. And yeah, so I'll do a separate routine for you guys for that. Make sure to go check out Amy's video. She's doing the night look, which I can't wait to see. And I hope you guys enjoy. Make sure to subscribe to her as well and give her some love. If you did, please give this video a humongous thumbs up so I can know. Make sure to subscribe and hit the bell next to the subscribe button to be notified every time that I upload. If you have any questions, comments, or concerns, leave them all down below. I'll get to them as soon as I can. Also, all my social media links will be down below. My Instagram, Snapchat, and Twitter will all be down there if you guys want to follow me on anything. Once again, I hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you next time. Bye, guys.